It's football's night of nights. Who will take Charlie home? Who will be the next champion Brownlow medalist? Tom Rockcliffe went to a few in his time. He actually polled a few votes. I think you were right amongst it one year. Yeah, I should have won it in 2013. You should have won yeah, it. Yeah, I should, should have won it. Oh, yeah. Sorry, Gary Ablett Jr. I polled two votes up until the halfway point. Last right. eight games, 19 votes, finished with 21. Didn't a few others finish above you? I was you? playing forward. Yeah, if I'd have been midfield all year, I would have oh, won the brown though that year for right sure. No though. doubt about that. But yeah, nah, one, one of the You're things... You're still bitter about yeah, it. Yeah, it got robbed. Now, now, Tom, what's it actually like being in the room? What's it like being in the room with all the footballs and leaders, the votes are being counted, the drama, the tension, it must be really special. One of the worst nights in history of Brownlow what? Night. Really? Yeah, you go there, you get these small portion size, they wouldn't fill you or me up. Oh. No steak, steak or chicken, I'm not sure like what they even serve now. Rabbit terrain or something walk, like that. Walk the red carpet at four o'clock in the afternoon. Like, four o'clock? Yeah, and then you go into this other waiting room before you go in, you get your call time, oh. walked around, and then you sit there all night. Listen to Gil count votes. Responsible serving of alcohol now. Well, because, you, you got to do that, obviously. Well, someone ruined it for everyone. Oh, they, who they, might that be? Used to be unlimited pressure point. Oh, did he play with you for one it, season? Yeah, he played at Brisbane, played at Carlton as well. Oh, and, I guess. Yeah. I think I know who you're talking about. Now you just can't get a drink. You can't go to the bathroom when you want to go. You've got. You might get locked out. And then, yeah. of course, the girls. The girls they doll up. That they're just normal people like yep. you and me, and they get berated in the paper. By get, fashion people who wouldn't know... By fashion experts. Who wouldn't know who you are. Wouldn't know who we are, yeah. they, and they berate the girls. There's nothing good about the Brownlow medal except for the winner, but you sit in the room all night listening to one person talk about votes. It's literally votes. an awards night where there's one award for the whole night. Not a heap of awards, one award. It's the longest night in history, most boring. You, you can't drink now, you can't eat. It's just, it goes on forever, Ugh. and the votes are just so one vote. See, Two, I'm sure oh. you. But it sounds like you were pretty happy if you heard Brisbane or Port Adelaide T Rockcliffe three oh, votes. That off, that happened very often. But oh. I tell you what, punters out there, if you get invited to the Brownlow don't medal, go. Decline. Decline. Do not yep. go. Go to the pub with your mates. You're better off. You get a nice chicken parma or something like yeah. that, and, and enjoy a few. And scooters. you're more likely to get a drink. Well, you can get a drink and you go to, to the bathroom when you need to go. Okay. So, in conclusion, being at the Brownlow sucks. What was Tony Jones complaining about? <laughs> Come bit. on, Chompers.